today is a fantastic day because hubby and I have the day off together. So we are currently on the way to Hidden Gym. I have another posing session with Tana, so I'm very excited about that. And afterwards, we are gonna crush a shoulder workout, so we're gonna take you guys along for that. And we have to stop by the Jiu Jitsu Gym. Gym. Boy. <laughs> gym. Jiu Jitsu Gym. Make New York. You know, York. it's fine. It's fine. But first, Bucky's. <sighs> anyway. But first, Bucky's. But first, Bucky's. I was gonna say, we may take you guys along for um, a supplement shop trip. And yeah, we just have a good day. So I decided I would vlog the day. And yeah, first we are gonna stop by the best place in the world. That is Bucky's in three. Okay, so just got done with posing practice. It was really good. I'm always pretty tired after posing practice because it's definitely effort and work, but we added more um, more stuff to today's posing practice. So we worked on our walking and um, kind of transitioning from side stage to center stage. So that was really cool and I'm excited to practice that um, for the rest of the week until I go back next week. So right now we are just having our snacks. I'm having a rice cake with a protein shake. What are you having? Two scoops of protein, two tablespoons of peanut butter. <laughs> I don't like you, but Perfect. <laughs> oh, good. Anyway, while I was posing, Chance got me some BCAAs. They are grape flavor. He also got whatever the heck. Let's go. Another blender bottle, as Let's if go. we needed another one. But this is uh, the Extend brand. I know they're pretty good, and they always have pretty good flavors. So I'm excited to give that a whirl, and we'll see you guys at the gym. You can call me stupid Yes, you can call me sheep You can say I lay a You can say I weep You think that using her would get to me And if you're right then you're in trouble D Cause I won't break, no I know I won't wait comes to her you better keep it seal don't you dare say a single word or i will strike you where it feels you think that using her would get to me and if you're right then you're in trouble d cause i won't break no i know i won't wait Thank you. 
y'all. We just got done at the gym and oh my goodness, I am feeling it. My shoulders are tired. So I had an amazing shoulder workout. Everything was pretty much timed. So instead of doing like three sets of 15, I did three sets of 50 seconds straight for lateral raises. That's just an example of the mini workouts that I did today. Um, so we did that and I went ahead and did my 35 minutes of cardio. I start out with five minutes of 155 heart rate and then I drop down to a 135 heart rate for the last 30 minutes. So that is definitely tough for me, but it was a great session. Um, for the post-workout snack, I had my Fruity Pebbles ISO 100 uh, protein, which I love. And then I was supposed to have pineapple, but I totally forgot to pack it today. So I'm gonna eat it as soon as I get home. Um, but yeah, so I'm actually having my lunch right now. I wanted to show you guys what I'm eating. I am having four ounces of sirloin right here and then some sweet potatoes that we uh, cooked in the air fryer this morning. I have three ounces. This is probably only like an ounce. I've already eaten quite a bit, but uh, this is like my favorite meal, steak and sweet potatoes. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm totally here for that. Anytime I get to eat steak, I am happy. So I've pretty much been able to eat steak this whole prep. So that has been really nice. Um, what we are doing right now is I am waiting on chance to get back with my new BCAAs because the ones we got were expired, which is crazy. I'm surprised they even had them on the shelf. So he's exchanging that real quick and then we're heading home to relax. So we'll see you guys later. Can we see the logo? It's, well, it's, it's that. It's that, pretty much. Wow. And this is a cool little bag I can take, too. Yeah, Adidas. Yeah. I like that. And this is Adidas, the uniform is. So, yeah. pretty cool. Can I help you <laughs> with something? What's up, y'all? Um, it is currently Friday, so everything that you guys saw was from yesterday and it is now 12.30 on the next day. Um, I had check-ins with my coach this morning. That was really good. I'm actually still waiting for a response, so he'll probably switch up the diet and the training for this upcoming week. I did hit a new low of 125.4 pounds. It honestly blows my mind um, seeing the number drop. From week to week um, I know the scale isn't everything but it is a tool to kind of help gauge progress and um, you know I could honestly care less what the scale says excuse me but it is interesting to see it shift when you're putting in the time and the work and the effort and everything um, but yeah I just wanted to hop on here real quick and give you guys an update and let you guys know um, if you're thinking about competing, that you, sh you should know that there are definitely days where you are not going to feel your best. For me, today is one of those days, unfortunately. My thought is, it's a beautiful, sunny Friday. Why aren't you happy? There's a hair on my hand. Um, you know, what's your deal? Like, you know, you should be happy. It's about to be the weekend. It's about to be 4th of July. But honestly, like, I could care less. Um, I have to turn my AC up. It is hot in Texas, that is for sure. <sighs> but yeah, I, um, I have zero motivation today. I am very just tired. I'm in a very weird, almost like lethargic mood. I don't want to go work out. I don't want to do my cardio. I don't want to prep any meals. I honestly just want to lay in bed in the AC all day and sit on my phone or watch TV or nap. And that is horrible. I am someone who, I like to work hard. I like to be productive. I like to get things done, all of that stuff. But I will say, I've had more of these days where I just don't have the motivation um, that I normally have and I think that is just something that happens when you get closer to your show date um, when you really start dropping weight you kind of go into like a zombie mode an autopilot mode I don't even know how you would describe it 
but I feel very like weird today and I just want to let you guys know that if you are on prep and you feel that way you are not alone I am totally here for you and I understand where you're coming from and also just to let those of you who have not competed and who want to compete you should know that there are going to be days where you just have to endure the suck like for real you got to suck it up and just do it I'm about to go to the gym right now I do not want to go but I have to this is what I signed up for like ultimately this is what I want this is a goal that I'm working towards this is something I've always wanted to do so in these weak moments I remind myself of where I'm headed how far I've come you know like I, I'm looking I was looking at progress pictures this morning and just seeing like from where my weight and my body has changed over the past um, seven weeks it has been absolutely incredible and I just have to think I am working towards getting up on stage like remind myself why I'm doing this and um, also you know it's important to like fill your coach in on how you're feeling hopefully you guys have a good coach who actually asks how you feel and how your week was um, that's a huge game changer I definitely let my coach know this morning I felt low energy this week and I was pretty hungry this week so who knows maybe maybe i can get a cheat meal tomorrow or an increase in calories this upcoming week something like that i don't know anyways i'm gonna go to the gym i'm gonna suck it up and get through my workout session and i just wanted to let you guys know prep is freaking hard so that's about all i have and if if you are enduring the suck right now keep enduring it keep pushing because you started this for a reason you have a goal you have a dream you have something in your heart that's like i need to go do this and just go do it just execute just get it done for the day get it knocked out one step in front of the other just do it and uh you will feel better after you get it done you may feel tired i'm probably gonna feel tired but that's okay what's up y'all so it is still friday it is i don't know like seven o'clock in the evening um i did finished my workout. I finished my cardio today. Um, it was tough getting through that workout because I was in such a mental fog this morning, but that's okay. I finished it and I feel so much better after the workout. I feel accomplished and um, my hard work is definitely paying off. Um, so I heard back from my coach. He said, I'm doing absolutely amazing and he thinks I'm going to be ready sooner than we thought. So as of um, right now we don't know exactly how many weeks I'm uh, how many weeks out I am but he said we are going to kind of look at the see how we're looking at the end of the month and then maybe look at a show in August um, so it's currently the beginning of July um, and he, he said we are starting a reverse diet on Monday and guess what you guys I get a cheat meal tomorrow I'm so stinking excited. <laughs> I'm so stinking excited for it. It's going to be absolutely amazing. I think we're going to go have sushi. Sorry, someone was just looking at me. I feel weird filming in, my, in the truck. <clears throat> but yeah, so really, really good things. My mood is definitely up because um, coach said I was just progressing so fast um, that we're going to actually start a reverse diet into a show sooner than we expected. So anyways that's just what I wanted to fill you guys in on and I'll see y'all later hey y'all so it is Saturday which means it is finally cheat day and I am so super excited for the meal that we are about to go have we are gonna go to one of our favorite sushi places it's called Hannah sushi and hibachi so we are gonna go indulge in a lot of sushi rolls and I'm gonna take you guys along for that and show y'all what we get here in just a few minutes and uh, yeah it's just been a really great day it is the 4th of July, so we spent most of our day out on uh, the lake. My parents have a boat and all that stuff, so we were just out there for a while, and I did uh, snack a little bit on the boat. I had a little bit of fruit and some vegetables and one of my you know, meals that's on my plan. So uh, overall, it was a really, oh, sorry for the bumps. <laughs> overall, it was a really good day. Um, got a lot of sun, definitely. Definitely feeling kind of tired, so didn't get dressed up for. <laughs> Dang, the freaking bumps! <laughs> Lord, 
sorry. Anyway, didn't get dressed up for this, but that's okay. I'm in my comfy, stretchy clothes, so uh, it's going to be good, and uh, we're going to have a great time.